And why did you choose this Carol Reed movie? Well, as I say, partly because um, it, it was one that um, uh, the episode that I told you that uh, that I tried to see it at the age of eleven, uh, and, and so it was it was among the lost films for a great many years. Uh, but I think it is. Uh, a very important Carol Reed film in that uh, it does contain all the uh, those little cameos of people at windows looking out, the, the, the two boys who see uh, Johnny in the garden and close the curtains um, as, as they uh, uh, look away from him. Uh, this was something which certainly went back to, to the stars look down uh, and indeed I mean he continued it it was it was also done in Vienna in in, in the third man um, but it has a particular aptitude in odd man out uh, I mean really if one is to evaluate read to the full one does need to see stars look down way ahead uh, Odd Man Out, and the uh, uh, the two Carl, the, the the two Graham Greene films, uh, Fallen Idol and uh, and Third Man, uh, and possibly also have another look at the uh, the one where he didn't actually find so much favour uh, when he tried uh, Conrad's Outcast of the Islands, uh, which I think one can say was the time when he. He, he, he lost his golden boy uh, status uh, but in many ways I think uh, Odd Man Out uh, and, and seeing it again uh, I'm reinforced in this view that uh, he was at uh, the height of his powers that imaginatively uh, and, and uh, contextually he was uh, doing some of his very best work. He had an actor in James Mason who he uh, really empathised with. Uh, he had a wonderful supporting cast, um, many of them from the, the, the Abbey Theatre. Uh, and of course it was uh, a very characteristic uh, Robert Kreska photography with the, uh, the, 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 the intense shadows and uh, uh, and bright lights, uh, and the narrative uh, gave that very, very great cameraman uh, just the sort of uh, atmosphere that he, he thrived in. So uh, I, I think it's a film that's been overlooked um, in the uh, in the canon, and, and, and that uh, everybody knows about the third man. Um, but Odd Man Out is, is, is to me in all respects a film of at least equal attainment.